Well, it's been a long wait for Gretna, but this weekend Gretna's own Italian Irish Parade is ready to roll. It all kicks off Sunday afternoon and after the parade. There's an after party. I'm loving that. Joining us this morning to tell us all about it is Parade Chairman Paul Lehman and Jefferson Parish Councilman Ricky Templet. Good morning, fellas. How you doing? Well, good morning, and thanks for having us. Yeah, no, I'm happy to have you yeah. here. I love it when men bring me a bunch of roses. So oh. It's always great. Or flowers. <laughs> Normally, you exchange a kiss for one of those. Okay. Here we yeah. No, that's okay. <laughs> Well, you said. All right. Yeah. Wait, so this is a, um, a, an event that you guys have been planning now for years. Well, you know, it's been started thinking about until about 2017 and 18. Uh, and then we're planning on pulling off the first Italian Irish parade in Gretna in 2020. But just like everyone knows, COVID did its we little deed on all of us. Oh, uh, yeah. So you had to kind of pull it back, but now finally getting to roll it all out. Well, and it was a quick rollout. We yeah. uh, started talking about this in um, about the beginning of January and a little over two months we have uh, over 28 floats and 73 wow. units march wow. groups bands we got a lot of units in this parade yeah that sounds like it's gonna be with, with over 600 month. riders you, yeah. you tell me who can put a parade together with over 600 like riders that. in less than two months Gretna can obviously well what where, where is it gonna take place what's the it, what's unique about it it takes the old traditional uh, Gretna route of all the parades back in the day it, co it starts on Franklin Avenue by Burmaster uh, and, and look at the parade starts at one, but there'll be a mass at St. Anthony's Church at noon. Okay. Okay. And then it takes the route to all, all of Gretna, uh, up Fish Street through the neighborhood of Willow, and then winds up on UEP Long Avenue and ending at the Farmer's Market. I like that little double back there. You see the uh, route there, so you can kind of plan out on where you're going to stake out your spot because with that many floats and that many fellas out there handing out flowers. Uh, you're definitely going to want to find a good spot uh, in, in Gretna. All right. It's going to be a, a lot of fun. What Some of the throws here. Yeah, yeah. yeah we, have, uh, we have cups with the Grand Marshals on it, uh, yeah. the crew's logo, the balloons. And uh, Ricky can introduce the Grand Marshals. And, and look, we, we, have, we have two great Grand Marshals. Our Italian Grand Marshal is John Alario. Okay. Okay. And our Irish Grand Marshal is Paul Connick. Okay, So it's yeah, going to be two. a great, yes. Two uh, Grand Marshals that certainly are grand and have a, a lot to speak for we there. We have our yeah. Queen. Okay. Uh, Cahill, and uh, she's excited about it. She three years in the making too. Right, yeah, what a, wait, what a wait! What a wait to rain! Yeah. I, I love it. I mean, it sounds like it's going to be a great time, and look, any chance that we get to extend the parade season is a welcome one. Fellas, thank you so much for coming in. We appreciate it. This weekend, Sunday, one o'clock in Gretna. It's going to be fun. Be there. All right, thank you. Appreciate